Hi guys and welcome to a walk around of a two bed penthouse that we've got just coming on now on uh, Latari Golf Resort. Entrance to the apartment is just down here. Just turn the lights on so we can see what we're doing. Um, so I'm just standing here on the landing, okay? So obviously you've got lift to all floors. You've, as you know, on, on Latari as well, you've always got underground parking spaces as well. So you've got an underground garage included or a parking space, I should say, included. Um, we're on Calle Remora. So you can see this is just the, the perimeter of the resort and lovely views at the other side as well, just of the, the orange and lemon groves. Very, very nice. And this apartment is fantastic fantastic i've obviously already done the images the 360 virtuals which will all all be on the website as well so make sure you actually have a good look at that um but this is a lovely apartment right okay i can't stress that enough so let's have a little look through and see what you think nice little surprise as well just before you walk into the actual door right because this this landing here is the only property up here is this apartment okay um and when you come up just before you go into the property itself you've got this cupboard here which is locked, okay? I've obviously opened it because we've got the key. So it's like a brilliant little storage cupboard for this apartment, okay? Now, it doesn't officially belong to this apartment, okay? So bear that in mind, um, because it was just a, a maintenance cupboard that was never used, right? So the guys just utilized it. So brilliant, brilliant little kind of advantage here, because that's one thing you don't get very much of here is actual bloody storage. Right, going into the apartment. Let us have a look. This is lovely, spotless throughout, really nicely furnished throughout. There is nothing to do here. Um, you know, it really is a lovely, lovely apartment. So when you walk in, you're walking into this kind of nice hallway area here. Um, again, lovely and modern here, really like the way they've done that. Um, kitchen directly to the left, which we'll go into first. And this hallway obviously leads up to the kind of little hallway area here where all your kind of bedrooms and bathrooms are off and then your lounge is just to the left. So let's start to the left. So as soon as you walk in the front door, directly to the left is the kitchen, okay? So let's open it up. Lovely, lovely and bright. Little things have been done here, which we'll kind of go through as we do it. So coming in, you've got your main oven, hob and hood. Now that's all the originals, but in brilliant condition. I mean, that looks perfect condition. This obviously was not there before. So this actual work top and cupboards here has been added at some point because that wouldn't have been there initially, uh, nor would that cupboard there. So that's all been added, which is great actually. It just gives uh, obviously more cupboard space, more worktop space. And then coming around to the left, you've got your kitchen here. So your kitchen, I'm, I'm pointing at the fridge freezer saying kitchen. You've got your fridge freezer here, washing machine down here, microwave, and here's something I've never seen before. An AC unit in the kitchen. Well, that's something I've never seen before. Um, but the guys do spend a lot of time in here, right? So that's why they said they put it in, because obviously it can get pretty warm in, in summer if they're cooking. Um, so that's, again, just a brilliant little bonus there. You've actually got an extra one in here. And then I love what they've done here. They've got the terrace on the outside. This is the utility room, obviously, on the outside of here, um, or it would have been originally. Um, and they've just made it in like an additional nice little terrace area. It's all been closed in using glass curtains. Looks brilliant. The actual tiles themselves, although they're exterior tiles, you can see they've been painted with like a special kind of tile paint. And it really looks good. I really like it. Looks really, really good. And you've just got a nice little table and chairs out here. Obviously somewhere they can have some breakfast and stuff in the morning or some lunch or dinner. Um, these glass curtains obviously all fold back so they all, all open up completely. A lovely view. I mean, look at the view. Straight over the pool to the golf course. Absolutely beautiful views. Really, really nice. Like what they've done here. So it's a lovely, lovely kitchen in my opinion. Um, little things been done obviously with the, the glass curtains on the terrace, the additional kind of cupboards there. AC unit in the kitchen, don't forget, it's a good one. Um, and all in perfect condition. As this whole apartment is, this is in perfect condition throughout. Right, out of the kitchen, take a left. Brings you, like I say, up to this kind of hallway area. You've got your lounge off to the left. Kind of nice kind of hallway, area. well, kind of like a, like a square, like rectangular kind of hallway area here with all of the other rooms feeding off of it. So let's start from the right hand side, which would be what, what most would regard as bedroom two, okay? Nice, good sized bedroom. As you can see, that's a, a proper big, I assume a double, let me just check. Yeah, proper big double, and that is a storage as well. Okay, so you've got a nice big storage bed. I think that might be a king as opposed to a double. So a big old bed, and it's a, a storage one as well, which is great. Again, really nice, clean, modern units throughout. Really does look very, very nice. It really does. Um, Inbuilt wardrobes as always with Latori. 
Again, AC unit up here. When I say AC units, these are all relatively new units, so these will be reversible, so they'll be heating and cooling. And then this is one of them kind of strange room twos that kind of go right back here in this corner. Um, and again, this is one of the styles that a lot of people have added second bathrooms to, which can be done. You can kind of square it off here and basically knock through into the existing bathroom, and then you basically just chop them in two and make two bathrooms. Um, I've seen it done before and it looks really good. Um, but that's something you can do if you want it. Um, but this, like, a, like I say, this apartment, in my eyes, you do not need to have to do absolutely anything. It is spotless throughout. You would walk in here and use it and be very, very happy about it. Right, back out into the hallway. Take a right is your bathroom. Okay, so everything's pretty much been changed here. The actual tiles haven't. The tiles are the original tiles on the wall and the floor. But obviously all the sink units have been changed where the bath would have been, that's been taken out and they've put a, a nice big shower unit in. Um, again, you've got the drawers over there. That's probably where the bidet would have been originally. So they've taken that out and put the, the actual a chest of drawers in for towel storage and stuff like that. And toilet over here. Around the corner here, again, don't forget you've got full gas central heating throughout on Latori, so that will be connected to that, okay? Um, so it's the towel heater slash radio co radiator connected to the main central heating system. And that's what's good about having the reversible AC units, right? Because if you are not wanting to heat the whole apartment, then obviously you can just use those units and heat one room at a time or cool one room at a time. Okay, and then taking a left into what is regarded as the master. Okay, so as always, a bit of a bigger room. Now this actual room has been set up as the twin, as you can see. Um, usually that would be the other way around, this being the master. It is usually always quite a bit, the master bedroom is usually about 25% bigger. On this actual style, I'd say it's more only like 10% or so. It's very little in it. Um, but of course, the master, breeze, one of the reasons it's regarded as that is it has direct access out onto the, onto the main terrace. Um, radiator there, as usual. Again, all nicely done in here. It just looks nice, clean, fresh. Like I said, I, I really don't think anyone would be buying this and doing much to it at all. Um, it's all been done very nicely. Again, AC unit up here. So this has got not only full AC throughout, but an extra one in the kitchen. So, you know, it's kind of full AC plus one. And then of course, like I said, this goes out onto this fantastic terrace, which will obviously lead to last as usual. Right, let's head back out into the kind of hallway area here. Spin round to the right into the lounge, which again, probably my favorite room of all. Um, lovely modern furniture, looks in fantastic condition. You've got a three seater kind of chaise lounge over there, a nice big comfy one seater there with a big kind of cushion, kind of puffy thing for your legs to put your feet up. Beautiful views from the window. Again, we're gonna go outside to the terrace in a moment. Nice big TV and soundbar over there. Now, as far as I'm aware of what I've been told is it's being sold fully furnished. Again, it's always, uh, the office will always confirm to you exactly what is saying and what is going. Fully furnished generally means that all the main furniture is staying. Um, so you always have gray areas, things like uh, TVs, for example, things like pictures, artwork, things like that. So we'll always confirm everything to you, um, obviously, um, at the time of the actual inquiry. Um, but it is coming fully furnished. All the main furniture you see stays. It's just a lovely, lovely property. It really is. Um, the furniture is really nice, you know, throughout. It's all very nice and in excellent condition. You know, it's obviously not been used massively. It's certainly never been rented. Um, it's, uh, yeah, it's in excellent condition throughout. Right, let's get out to this terrace because this is where it really just jumps another level up again. Right, so the first thing I note when I'm coming out is, is at some point this has been sealed. You know, you just get like a, a, like, a, it's like a liquid stuff that basically seals the terrace. Because before that, the outside terraces were what you call porous, right? So if you drop wine or drink co or, or Coke or any kind of liquid, it actually sinks through the actual tiles. Um, once they're sealed, that doesn't happen. You could just basically wipe them off, obviously, just like ceramic tiles. So it just, uh, a lot of people do get that done. Um, yeah, and it looks relatively good condition still. You know, they do have to be redone every few years, um, but this looks in pretty good nick. As you walk out, the first thing obviously you notice is it's a lovely big, big terrace, okay? This is one of them nice big kind of wraparound ones. Um, you've got a large kind of six-seater table over here, barbecue tucked away in the corner over there. Um, just got your little, your little hose rule there. Um, they've actually put, a, you know, kind of a netting over this part, over the pergola area, obviously just to get some shade. Um, but yeah, again, lovely, looks lovely. It's a lovely, great size. 
we're going to check them views out in a minute which are i think stunning so sticking to the terrace all the way along to the ends and then take a left and it goes back here where you've got these two sun beds fantastic sized terrace guys and views seriously the views are absolutely stunning so you've got this big huge pool just below you and then just straight out onto the jack nicklaus golf course it really is beautiful views from here fantastic really is it's a lovely lovely property guys penthouse um only one we've got on our books um i know that there is just nothing on the books on every, on anyone's books at the moment um and the stuff that comes on goes very very quickly um, price wise okay this one's coming on at 146,995 so just shy of 147,000 euros don't forget that's fully furnished everything in here stays so this literally is what I would like to say a turnkey this is where you walk in and use straight away really do not have to spend any money on this property at all uh, community fees on this one I believe is 164 per month again don't forget on Latori that includes your internet um, international TV stations and even an internal phone line so you can book one of the many restaurants that are now open on site um, or you know book your golf or, or, or whatever or, or actually ring just anybody uh, ring anybody within the resort itself any other apartment any other property beautiful penthouse it really is I really like this one um, I really can't see this going past one or two viewings um, as soon as it hits the site if you've got any questions of course let us know as always um, I can be reached on inquiries at polarisworld.org.uk. Um, if you want questions answered quickly, um, then you just ring our office number. Now, in Spain, the office number is 968-032042. If you're watching this from the UK, and I always say that because statistically around 65 to 70% are UK viewers, um, you can always get us on 0208 zero nine zero three six three one that will be transferred to our office here on the Torrey, but you're not paying for that you're just paying as if you're calling someone in the uk which is generally free now right a lovely property guys if you're interested in a penthouse if you're interested in something that is literally key ready stunning views got the bonus of that lovely big storage cupboard as well full ac throughout plus one i've never said that before you know that one in the kitchen um it's uh yeah it's brilliant absolutely brilliant cheers guys